Yesterday seemed like the day, uh, like today we have clips where it just seems like our um, our exiting or exited political leaders are really, really trying to make it clear exactly who they are and have been. Here is Paul Ryan sporting a, uh, a couple of days worth of growth that tell us he's on his way out. He knows that he's no longer the guy, but he's going to remind us that you know, I was an idiot, and then uh, I was uh, considered someone who was under the gun. I had to act like an idiot because I'm surrounded by idiots, and my political fortunes are are uh, constrained by idiots. The idiot in the White House, the idiots in my caucus. But now, look at my beard. I'm free. What I say now is in my heart, and I'm going to adopt the exact same conspiratorial frame as all the idiots who I pretended were the idiots who were forcing me to act like an idiot before have done. In, in California, it just defies logic to me. We, we, we had a lot of wins that night. We were only down 26 seats the night of the election. And three weeks later, we lost basically every contested California race. This, this election system they have uh, I, I can't begin to understand what ballot harvesting is, but so I think California. You, do you think there's something wrong with it? No, I just think it's weird. I mean, okay. in Wisconsin, you know, we knew like the next day. You know, Scott Walker, my friend, I, you know, was sad to see him lose, but, but he, we accepted the results on Wednesday. You know, so, you know, I think we had California. Uh, their their system is bizarre. I still don't, frankly, understand it. Uh, there are a lot of races there. We should have won. And we got massively outspent. I mean, big time outspent. All right, pause gotta... it for one second. Before we get to him crying about how uh, the, the Republicans got outspent by the massive fundraising, small donor fundraising that existed on the Democratic side. There's a lot of big money, too. But uh, guess what? The Republicans got big money as well. Uh, they got outspent because people wanted them uh, uh, booted out. It was the largest, largest midterm victory in terms of votes. Uh, in the history of midterms and something funny going on. It's all red flaggy over there in, in, in California. I don't understand it, but what's that ballot harvesting? I'm not going to talk about it, but anyway. What yeah, is I'm just going to drop a ballot harv harvesting. That I mean, what does that mean? I'm going to give you the search term that you can go to find yourself in the part of the Internet that's going to tell you exactly what we need you to know. Yeah, let's see what ballot harvesting gets you on uh, the Internet. Let's see. Ballot harvesting. What was it? What was Paul Ryan talking about? Well, it's all now Paul Ryan, but let's do it. Um, just uh, we'll do it. Just um, let's see. Custom range. We'll go in. Let's do it uh, the day before he said that. How's that? And uh, then it's like, let's see. Would you give your ballot to a stranger? No, nothing. There's no word to that. Oh, here it is. Red state. This is in this is in October. California Democratic Party sinking to new lows to harvest absentee ballots. Mm -hmm. In November 13th, there is ballot harvesting going in Sutter County. Um, just like grow them in the fields. No, it's basically Montana could ban ballot harvesting. In, Here's uh, a funny September headline from Arizona Capital Times. Uh, Ninth Circuit upholds ballot harvesting quote. That's a quote. Ban. Uh, calling the... Oh, sorry. This, this got blocked. What is ballot harvesting supposed to be? Calling the lack of evidence of fraud irrelevant. A divided federal appeals court on Wednesday upheld Arizona's ban on quote ballot harvesting. Let's see. If it's I think it's basically going around and, and helping uh, collect people's uh, ballots so that they will send their absentee ballots out. Black ballot, check. White ballot, ooh, can't make that one out. Throw it out. That's a little thing called uh, Let's listen harvesting. to him now whine about money. Of all people to whine about money in elections, this guy, uh, his whole career has been based upon Koch's uh, money, giving him money. Stand it. Uh, there are a lot of races there. We should have won. And we got massively outspent. I mean, big time outspent. You got a couple of billionaires dropping hundred million dollars on your head, uh, and that 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 leaves a mark. And so we got massively outspent. 
Uh, we had midterm headwinds, which are traditional things. And we do, we do have to face up that there's a suburban voter issue that we have to attend to, which, which was what our concern was all along. Yeah. In other words, let's get to the legit reason at the end. People hate Republicans now. And then uh, now that we have all the other ones that are out there that, that will get the attraction on Breitbart. That's what we've done. We've been able to do that. Just not interested.